Saturday and I'm feeling a little under the weather today. I think I might have COVID or something like that, but um, I was supposed to go to my nephew's football game and we ended up not going because I don't feel great. And um, so we are going to go grocery shopping today instead of going tomorrow since it's supposed to storm all day. So we are just gonna bring you guys along with us on our grocery shopping trip and I have a lot of stuff to get. So I'll do a haul for you guys and let you know everything that I got. And um, later, I want to paint pumpkins and watch a Halloween movie or something because we have literally not done anything Halloween-esque this whole month of October so far. So maybe we'll do that and um, I'll film that for you guys as well. So yeah, we're just about to head there now and Nathan just woke up. So I'll see you guys when we get there. finally back home this looks like a lot i'm aware but um we don't normally buy groceries like this like i normally bulk buy stuff from like sam's club and like costco so that way like i can go like a bunch of time without buying anything so except for you know like main ingredients for recipes but it's really been like oof it's been like a good three months i would say since i've actually bought like a, a ton of groceries like this so just fair warning, like, this is a lot because it's been so long. So, um, this is literally everything together. A mixture of Sam's, Costco, and Walmart. So, I'll show pretty much everything that I got. So, I got some chicken thighs. And then I also got more chicken thighs. These are only $12.73 per thing. And it's like, these are already prepackaged and everything. So, I really like that. So, I'm going to, like, I won't have to separate these out like I would these, so that'll be nice. And then, um, this should literally last me through the end of the year, probably, or last us, you know, so, uh, yeah. So, I got chicken thighs for meat, and then I also got some ground chicken, because I'm going to be making some uh, ground chicken turkey meatballs, and I might film the recipe for that. I'm not sure yet. It just depends on how I am with time. And then, um, I needed some more Rotel, so I got that. And then all the things that I'm talking about right now, I got from Sam's Club so far. And then I did get some holiday, uh, Starbucks holiday blend coffee because I needed some more coffee, and I like that one, so that one works. And then I got some chicken broth. I needed some chicken stock for like soups and stuff like that. And then some recipes. And then the pistachios. Those are for Nathan for snacks for work. And then I got some Glad um, trash bags. These have literally, I bought these um, before one other time. Like I think when we first moved into this apartment. And I've not had to buy them since then because... Um, there's so many in here. It literally lasted me like a whole year and more. So, um, and then I got, I think that might have been all that I got from Sam's Club, except I also got this from Sam's Club, these, uh, chicken fajitas. Usually like one of these bags is like $10 or more. So just, or not $10, I'm sorry, probably like seven or $8 or more and then like for a two pack it was only like twelve dollars so like these are great for like lunches and stuff like that so and then i also i think like i said that and then 
I think I got these. No, I think those are from Costco. I got those from Costco. Never mind. So, um, that's all that I got from Sam's Club. Other than I did get some Kerrygold butter. And then this was actually on sale for like $4. So, I got this um, teriyaki marinade. Because I'm going to make some um, teriyaki chicken bowls. So, that is all that I got from Sam's Club. And then, so the next things I'm showing you, I got from Costco. So, except for these Tide Pods. I got those from Sam's Club too, sorry. Um, I got these sweet potato fries from Costco. They have these in um, this huge bag. And they're already like pre-seasoned. They're great to cook in the air fryer. I do it all the time with burgers and stuff like that. I love these. So, I got two big bags of these. I got some of these baby peppers because I love these for, you know, just snacks or like even like to cook with if you don't want to use like a whole bell pepper. Like you have these, you can use these. And then, oh, I did get this, this heavy cream from uh, Sam's Club as well. But, um, and then I got these from Costco too for um, Nathan's lunches. And then some of this earthbound farm baby spinach i got that from costco as well and then they have like a huge produce section at costco where they um just have like a bunch of like produce so i got these broccoli florets from there because i'm going to be making some recipes for the next two weeks that have broccoli in them i actually made a meal plan um for the next two weeks so that way i could like not have to go grocery shopping and already have what i need so I got these for Nathan's lunches as well. Since he's on night shift, um, this kind of works better because he doesn't want to bring a full lunch because he's not going to need one. So, I also got, let's see. Oh, sorry, I forgot to mention these two. <laughs> sorry, there was a bunch of stuff I got from Sam's Club apparently. I got these from Sam's Club and these low-carb tortillas. And then I also got this... Um, albacore premium albacore wild caught solid white uh tuna i always buy these this is the only kind of tuna that i buy from sam club as well and then so i got these eggs from sam or i got these eggs from costco and then everything else that i'm going to show you i got from walmart so i got and then i'm going to make some euros so um, sometime this week or next week. So I got these whole wheat Greek style pitas. Comes with like six, which is honestly way too many for just us, but maybe we'll use them for sandwiches another day. And then, um, also got some scissors. Nathan needed those. And then these sponges, some popcorn. We eat a lot of popcorn around here. It's a pretty low calorie snack, so we like to enjoy it. And then I really like these cherry cordial things and I saw them out and I was like, you know what, I'm just going to grab some so that way I have some here in case I want one every now and then. And then, um, let's see, we got some Ajax. We just got that for dishes and stuff like that. And we are painting pumpkins today. Nathan is actually getting the pumpkins out of the car now because we left them in there by accident. So, um, we got pumpkins they're pretty big. I'll show you guys before we paint them what they look like. We just got those from Walmart from the selection that they had left. It is pretty late in October, so they did not have a whole lot to choose from. But I got some paints to paint them with. Um, I already have some, but I didn't know what colors I might still need, so I grabbed this one. And then I grabbed white because I knew that I was low on the white kind that I did have. And then we just got some of these paintbrushes in case we needed paintbrushes. These were pretty cheap. And, um... I think we bought this at Walmart too. We needed a new sponge. And let's see. What else I got? Some Rao's homemade pasta. Some all-purpose Greek seasoning. I got this to season the chicken with for when we make the gyros. Um, Nathan doesn't like feta cheese, so I won't be putting that on it, unfortunately. And then I got some green chilies for... I'm going to make... Um, some like white chicken enchiladas one day and that is what I'm gonna need for those and then I got some more seasonings they had some McCormick garlic and herb black pepper and sea salt seasoning I thought that would be a good one and then uh ground cumin let's see southwest chipotle blend and I think that is everything that I got so yeah 
all of this all together cost me about about four hundred and sixty dollars but just keep in mind you know like i said like i don't buy groceries like this all the time like usually this stuff that i bought right now is going to last us for multiple months in a row so um normally my grocery days don't typically cost this much this was just one of those things where i wanted to buy enough groceries where we don't have to buy groceries for like the rest of the year for like big stuff so yeah that's how much everything cost and i'm gonna put all of this away now and then i'll see you guys when we are painting pumpkins oh wait he brought the pumpkins i'll show you what they look like those are our pumpkins so yeah we got white ones because that's all they had left I am eating a burrito for dinner from our favorite taco bus. Nathan actually got uh, food from Costco, so it's just me eating this. But um, it's a huge burrito. It's a steak burrito. It's really good. I love getting stuff from that place. It's like one of our favorite places, so yeah. I'm just going to eat that real quick, and then after that, I'm going to set up our pumpkin painting stuff, and then we're going to start doing that. All right, guys, we're about to start painting our pumpkins. Little tail on the back too. So cute. Oh, first pumpkins. 